For this lesson, I'm going to cover Access Data's Forensic Toolkit. Access Data's Forensic Toolkit combines an extensive array of computer forensic tools into a single standalone software suite. It allows investigators to analyze a computer's hard drive and search for files, folders, emails, documents, pictures, and any remaining evidence that might have been deleted or altered. Once the files have been identified, FTK provides a report feature to document the forensic analysis and the procedures used and help investigators build their case. FTK's graphical user interface, GUI, is easy to use. It organizes all digital evidence into buckets that identifies the file types, such as documents, graphics, spreadsheet, and so forth. Forensics investigators need to search large volumes of data stored on different types of storage media, such as floppy disks, CDs, and DVDs, flash drives, and hard disk drives for potential digital evidence. So in many criminal cases, the suspect might have attempted to delete a file or modify it in some way to prevent other users from seeing it. FTK can recover deleted or corrupted files and display the content even if they are encrypted with a password. FTK includes powerful search tools that enables investigators to search for specific keywords or number of patterns that might reveal telephone or credit card number related to crimes. In order to use Access Data's Forensic Toolkit, you'll need to install the FTK Forensic Toolkit as well as the known file filter database known as the KFF. The KFF database stores file signatures of popular software products. The KFF library is a database that provides file signatures for popular software programs such as Microsoft Word or Excel. So what are file signatures? File signatures are hexadecimal values obtained mathematically from computer files and programs to determine their originality and authenticity. The KFF file signatures are compared with the file signatures obtained from the hard disk files, and any match indicates that the files have not changed since they were created by the software vendor. This process allows investigators to concentrate on user-generated files while avoiding vendor software files that do not contain any potential evidence. So in review, FTK is an important forensic tool because it can be used to help computer forensics investigators locate potential digital evidence. FTK can search for email, graphics, and modified files. A digital signature or hash is a hexadecimal value mathematically obtained from a file. The KFF stores file signatures and hashes of popular software products. And lastly, the KFF is useful in a computer forensic investigation because it allows investigators to concentrate on files changed by the suspect. Now then, let me show you how to install Access Data Forensic Toolkit. First, click on FTK Forensic Toolkit and run it as admin. Next, click on KFF and run that as admin as well. OK, just ignore this and click OK.
ignore this error and just click OK. Also click OK. All right, for this, click Cancel. Now go to Tools, Preferences, and just make sure that the KFF database location is listed. In this case, it is. Everything looks good. Whenever you're ready, just click OK. All right, and that's how you install Access Data's Forensic Toolkit. Thank you for watching.